It's been discovered there is a better and safer emergency treatment for potentially fatal seizure victims, and Glendale Fire played an important role. The bottom line of a national two-year-long study showed that injecting an anticonvulsant medicine into the thigh is a safe and effective way of stopping a prolonged seizure lasting more than five minutes. Is that it turns out not only is the uh, intramuscular injection as safe as the intravenous injection, but in fact, it is superior to the IV injection to stop seizures before the patients arrive at the hospital. And the reason why that is so important is uh, within five to 10 minutes of an ongoing seizure, a person actually starts having uh, death of the brain cells. And so in the midst of that brain cell death, waiting until the hospital to stop the seizures ends up with people, for instance, rather than going back to school, ending up in a nursing home. We have an answer to an incredibly important healthcare problem that is safer for the paramedics who are caring for the patients and actually, in fact, does a better job of treating. The results are significant. Nearly twice as many people die of prolonged seizures than those who die as a result of traffic crashes. The U of A and Glendale Fire partnered in the study and Glendale paramedics were singled out for their efforts. Almost every single patient that could have been involved in this trial was entered into the trial by uh, Glendale Fire. That that record was by far the best of all the 33 paramedic units and fire departments across the country that participated in this trial. The seizure treatment study is providing an important bonus for Glendale Fire. We've never known as, as paramedics what the temperatures will do to drugs uh, when they ride inside these trucks. You know, it gets 120 degrees here inside the truck, it can get up to 130, 140 degrees inside the compartments. Does that degrade the effectiveness of the drug? They agreed to do that study along with the Rampart study, and out of that, we've, we've got some very good information about the uh, eff effectiveness of the medicines that we carry and whether we need to keep them cool or, or heated or whatever the case may be. And that study is ongoing, and we're looking at, at a number of things. Seven area hospitals also participated, among them Arrowhead and Banner Thunderbird here in Glendale.